The heart of the ICT philosophy here at Ginogli is to really embed um, innovative teaching and learning into the curriculum through the use of uh, state-of-the-art ICT. The ICT is, is a tool, it's an enabler for us to really push extended learning opportunities and innovative learning opportunities across to the youngsters through, through personalisation of the, of the curriculum and through um, anytime, anywhere learning opportunities as well. This year's Year 7, I'll be beginning to get a different experience from last year's Year 7. We are starting to enable the, the Year 7s to, um, to blog, to, to wiki, to have discussion forums, and um, those kind of things to really um, build on that, that collaborative aspect of the learning experience. We've adopted an Australian strategy which is known as Rich Tasks. This is only our third year of doing this. The children's learning patterns are form far more advanced than the children who haven't undergone rich task type education. The rich tasks model designates year seven as a period where children are taught lifelong learning tools rather than the more conventional curriculum structure. Each term a class is given a project which draws together a whole range of subjects. Well at the start of the year or whenever you come then you get to choose um, drama, dance or music. We're split up into pods, each of 70 children, four pods. At the end of the term, then they all got together and then we all practised for a performance. At my old school then we didn't do any of this because we only had about 17 computers in the whole school. So um, yeah, it's really fun using all the technology. We're very, very interested in making what we call lifetime learners. Our very first lessons together here in class were actually finding out how they learn. There are various methods of learning like audio, visual and kinesthetic and with our pupils what we've done is to teach them this and they have found out their own learning style and from that we can give them tasks and they can go away and know how to set about that task because of the best way of learning for them. We are um, designing a costume on the laptop, something to do with um, horror and it's like a um, mum's basically holding a knife in his hand and I'm just conjuring it around. Here we're a career orientated academy so we've tailor made the national curriculum to fit in with our children's needs. When pupils progress from year 7 to year 8 things change for them. They take those skills with them up into year 8 but then they get a dedicated ICT teacher. The ICT teachers will build on this and that will develop all the way through to year 11 with the various projects that they will do. We have the, the vision in place, the pedagogical vision is there. Um, what we are now looking at is how do we build the next level of ICT provision around that, that um, pedagogical vision. Every bit of information I've got is now stored digitally and through ICT I can put anything I want to on the boards, whether it be video, worksheets, or even parts of books now. It's all digitised and it's there instantly. And that, I feel, is going to be the way forward for the future. It's more interesting and you get to learn things and do more on computers instead of paper and pen. I've been here at Genoglin for 18 years. I should have retired, but I enjoy it so much I decided not to. This is right at the cutting edge of education.